like the ball's an inch or two in well at least an inch in front of center more off like off your left pocket Yeah, we'll get into that in a second. And what I did to fix that was I moved the ball backwards. I moved it towards my center. If you take the club too far to the inside and you get too far, watch your head here. This is why you're having trouble. Off. It moves to the right a lot. So when you get that far behind it, your tendency will be to hit behind it. Yeah, I'm basically banging the ground. Yeah. So that's why you got to stay more on top of it. Stay on top of the ball. Yeah. Now, with with your uh, ball position a little forward, when you swing back, I don't know if you can sense that or feel it. But you're definitely moving, you know, a good six inches. The reason that your head moves to the right a lot is your left shoulder does not go down enough on the backswing. So when you turn back, your shoulders should turn on a slightly more tilted plane. So look, you're turning on a, on a horizontal plane. It should be more on a tilted plane. Does that make sense? Now, is that something I would say go to the course with? No, but it's something you can practice. And the way you can practice it is stand with your forehead like against the door jam and just practice making your left shoulder go down and keeping your forehead right on the wall right on the door jam but you're not not moving in front of it at all so that's good if anything you're moving a little too far to the behind it on the backswing and then you're just 